Hey guys, subscribe for daily knife content. And if you're shopping for knives and gear, make sure you check out the description of the video you're watching right now for links to some great online retailers. There's also individual links for knives that I personally recommend. Thanks. What's going on YouTube? Metal Complex here, and today I've got another short little unboxing. Well, it's actually just an unpouching to share with you guys. So quick story. This, I think, came in on a Saturday, and I did that thing where I, I don't film on Saturdays, but I still go to the post office, and I was like, oh my gosh, I know what this is, and I just ripped it open, and I was like, ah, you know, I, <laughs> and then I realized I never actually did the, I never actually recorded the unboxing that I planned to record later the next week. So anyways, this is definitely something I want to share with you guys, one that I'm really excited about, one that you might have seen if you follow me on Instagram. Sometimes I do sneak peeks and stuff there. Um, anyways, thanks so much to my generous patrons for supporting me. There's a link for my Patreon right down in the description. And please make sure to follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. Apparently that's not going to come off. Okay. Anyways, what do we have here? We have another Vero. Yeah, but this is different. This is a different one. First off, there's a note real quick. Let me get into that here real quick. Ah, MC, this Vero Synapse XL is my most carried user. You can use this to cut or test out however you like. Hope you enjoy it as much as I do. Thanks for all your content. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, that was from my buddy, Nate. That's really nice when people say, go ahead and use it and carry it. Um, yeah, so here's what we've got here, guys. We have a Vero Synapse x l oh let me tell you something i've been playing with this thing <laughs> i like the uh i like the synapse i think i've talked about this in a live stream before i like the synapse i like the accent this xl is so so good and here's another reason why i like it i like the tumbled finish on it uh, the other ones that I've handled had the satin finish. This tumbled finish looks so good on this guy. And I think it's actually less expensive. You guys might be wondering, where do you get that? Where do you get that? Are you just showing another knife that we can't get? Sometimes the knives that I show on the channel, the most interesting stuff is periodically unavailable. But I believe uh, Mr. Vero is going to continue production on these. So more should become available in the future. I have no idea when. Your best bet is to go to the Vero Engineering website and sign up for uh, email notifications if you can or their newsletter. And also follow them on Instagram so that you know when stuff's coming out. That's what you've got to do. Um, without showing stuff like this on the channel, I think it would be kind of boring, right? Uh, this particular one has an upgrade upgraded uh, Timascus clip and Timascus backspacer. So if you find yourself in a situation where you are actually able to order one, there may or may not be options like that available, but you can rest assured that it will add cost to the knife. What's the steel on it? M390. Is the lockup good? Yes. Is the centering good? Yes. This is a big knife that carries like a much smaller knife. And my good, listen, the, syn the standard synapse I like the size of it. And because of the handle profile, there's a lot of ergonomic freedom. So I'm still able to get a roomy four finger grip on it. But this guy, this speaks to my hand a lot better. I really, really like the uh, Vero Synapse XL. And if I was gonna pick up a Vero, which I'm still kind of considering, I have a lot of, this channel has a monthly budget, right? So it's almost always dedicated to something. But if I find myself down the road, down the road, able to dedicate a portion of my uh, budget to, you know, something like this, um, I think I would probably do it. I'm very interested to see what uh, Mr. Vero does in the future. Uh, guys, obviously, pretty dedicated, pretty focused on the brand, trying to put out more, trying to do things right. Um, so I'm very interested to see what else comes out down the road. The reason that this one appears to be so much more fall shut than the other ones, if you guys watched my unboxing of the, uh, the standard size synapse and uh, the unboxing and review of the Axon. I think it probably has a lot to do with the weight and mass of the blade. The blade is definitely a little bit thicker. It's also a little bit longer and taller. So there's definitely more mass there, but it does feel quite a bit smoother. I don't know what the deal is with that. Maybe this one's just broken in from use and carry, right? Yeah, I'm gonna be spending some time with that guy. I'm pretty uh, pretty excited about it. Um, that's going to be pretty much it for today, guys. I just wanted to make sure and unbox and actually share this with you, give you guys my initial thoughts. I have not really gathered enough 
information or, you know, I haven't really put my thoughts together in a way that um, where I can review it right now. If you guys are, you know, confused, if you're new, what, what, where's the review? It's not a review. It's first impressions, right? I've only had this for a little tiny bit. Uh, rest assured, two to three weeks down the road on this channel, you will get a full comprehensive review of this knife. So uh, watch out for that. Anyways, be sure to follow me on Instagram at Metal underscore Complex. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on that Metal Complex. They'll go right there and subscribe because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.